My name is Marcelo Vignali, and I am helping out on the project, uh, putting together a comic book, and then I'm going to be doing some character design for the project. At one point, the character is going to be looking at a comic book, and this comic book has to be designed. We can't have it be an actual comic book because it has to hit certain beats that we're going to hit in the film. So we have to design that, and that's where I come in. And this is the part where Miles has that realization, oh my gosh, I'm Spider-Man. And he realizes this by looking at a comic book. The original Spider-Man comic, and it's funny because I picked it up and I'm going through the comic book and it's, and it's really simple. And so I thought, okay, so let me have a look at what was the, some of the structure that uh, John Romita had because John Romita followed uh, Ditko and I created sort of this hybrid between the two styles. One is I wanted to hit the original style of what was done in the first comic, but I needed to have a little bit more than that and I reached over uh, at John Romita for some of that structure. So in a sense it's sort of a hybrid and there's a little bit of me in there as well as I try to put all of that together. The computer is a wonderful tool, it's absolutely marvelous, but it has a particular look to it. I just don't think it'll be the same if I tried to ink it in the computer. It's a dynamic process that's happening, so I'm not just getting my assignment and finishing it. I, I'm getting my assignment and then working with them to finish it. So once they had a look at what I was doing with the comic book, they started figuring like, well, we should probably add a couple pages here and there. So it's actually changing even as I work on it. I am so excited about seeing this on the film. Not, not just because I'm going to be part of it, because I'm a Spider-Man fan. <laughs>